And I'm Paul Sabulo. Today is December 2nd, and we're here with your distance learning announcements. This year's soccer is a spring sport. Tryouts begin February 22nd, 2021. For more details, contact Coach Matt at the email shown. Stanford Women in Business is a pre-professional undergraduate organization that aims to empower young women to become leaders in the business world. The annual Free Young Women's Leadership Summit will be held virtually on January 23rd and 24th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. What's up, Wolfpack? I'm John Sheehan, back at it again with your weekly sports update. This week, we're going to be discussing when and if we will be able to attend sporting events in the 2021 year. One aspect of life we all miss since COVID-19 hit is attending packed stadiums to cheer for your favorite team at a sporting event. When asked if NBA arenas could be full for the postseason in July, Dr. Fauci, the nation's leading immunologist, said, quote, I think that'll be cutting it close, end quote. He went on to explain that they will be testing high-priority people during late December, January, February, and March of next year. And, quote, by the time you get to the general public, the people who will be going to the basketball games who don't have any underlying conditions, that's going to be starting end of April, May, June. So it will probably be well into the end of summer, end quote. So most likely we will go through another basketball season without fans. But on the bright side, for you football fanatics, Fauci is very hopeful NFL games could be packed in September of 2021, saying, quote, Oh, that's possible. I think that's possible, end quote. With Major League Baseball season starting at the end of March and continuing to the end of October, you may see some of the regular season and the entire postseason with packed stadiums. Unfortunately, it looks like Fauci is predicting another 10 months before we see sporting events packed with stadiums again. But with the way 2020 is going, who knows what's going to happen. That's all I have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm John Sheehan, and this has been your weekly sports update. That's all I have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Paul Sabulo. And I'm Kaliota. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy National Mutt Day, Wolfpack.